Good morning, CLHS. Today is October 1st on this Double Day 4. I'm Kennedy. And I'm Taylor. Today on RTV, we will have all your school news, and later in the show, we will welcome Dinik Bicot for an in-house interview about cross-country. Your RTV starts in... 5, 4, 3, 2, 6th, there will be approximately 20 post-secondary institutions at Cold Lake High School from 9 to 11.30 for grade 12s to collect information or ask any questions. Grade 12s will be visiting the display in Block 1. The yearbooks are coming. Get your copy Monday at lunch by the theater. ID may be requested. If you love to write, check out the bulletin board inside Ms. Schwab's classroom. There are now three short story contests and three poetry contests. Board Game Club will be today at lunch in Mr. Nichols' room. Bring your lunch and get ready to play some Catan. We'll be right back with more announcements, but first, let's go to Dylan with our Mach 1 weather report. Hi, I'm Dylan. This is your Mach 1 weather report for Thursday, October 1st. Currently, today's high is 22 with a low of 8. Winds are blowing from the southeast around 10 kilometers per hour, and humidity is 66%. Tomorrow is a high of 16 with a low of 7. Saturday's high is 6 with a low of 2. And Sunday is a high of 6 with a low of 5. That was your weather. Have a great day, CLHS. There's a GSA meeting today at lunch room 1405. Come on out to the fields north of the school today at lunch for the annual student versus staff football game. CLHS staff wants to get revenge and defend their title. The lunch special today is soft taco for $5 and chicken noodle soup for $3. Are you an aspiring actor, filmmaker, or editor? The FCSS is having a film contest and the topic is bullying and the theme is empowering change. There are two contest categories. The deadline to enter is Friday, October 9th and films will be screened at Assumption on October 23rd from 6 to 9. Are you interested in a legal career or just learning about the legal process? You should consider joining CLHS's new mock trial team. If you're interested, please see Mr. Wan or Ms. Hedberg. That's all for your news today, CLHS. But first, let's go to Kennedy with our in-house interview. Good morning, Colic High School. I'm here with one of the JV cross country runners. So, how have you been training for the race? Well, since the beginning of the school year, Mr. Kaminsky has had a cross country program started for everybody, and we just run uh, three to four times a week. All right. Do you know how many people are exactly going to the race for the JV section? About ten, approximately. Okay. What do you think is going to be the hardest part about the race? Definitely the beginning, because there's so many people and it's definitely hard to get a good start. All right, thank you. Have a great day, CLHS. 